Okay, this is a preview of the Scamper robot kit. Um, I'm still programming it at the moment. Basically, you have three sets of uh, Omni wheels. Uh, they have an anodized aluminium chassis. Uh, there's a commotion control shield at the top. You have a uh, uh, 6 AA battery pack in here, although you can put in a lithium ion battery pack if you want. And underneath, we have these uh, three mo geared motors the metal geared motors, and when you look carefully, at the back of each motor is an encoder. Uh, there's an 8 pole magnet there and um, a Hall effect sensor. So it gives you 8 state changes uh, per revolution of the motor. The gearbox is a 78 to 1 gear ratio. Uh, so now, at the, uh, you've got a nice little power switch here on the back, nice and easy to use. As you can hear. The, um, the software I've got in at the moment uses the motors for speakers. <coughs> Apart from play, playing a nice little tune, uh, the uh, motors can also vibrate to let you know what mode it's in or whatever. Um, I won't go into too much detail on the commotion shield at the moment. Um, basically at the moment I'm programming it using um, uh, Sparkfun Redboard here which just a uh, standard Arduino controller and for testing I have uh, just an infrared receiver there. The infrared receiver is just plugged straight into the shield with um, the signal going straight to pin 2 which is a external interrupt and the other two pins provide power. Uh, let's see, let's see what else we've got here. Uh, that's right. For the Scamper robot kit, we have a little sensor board on the front here. This is just a little infrared uh, sensor and uh, we'll use it for line following and maybe object detection. Don't know how well they'll work yet. Okay. I've just set it up on the floor here. You can see there's a, a track that I'm using just for testing the um, scamp code software. But for the moment, I'm just using remote control. Uh, with the velocity and angle, okay, this can be hard to keep up with. Basically, the if you think of the sensor, hang on, think of the sensor at the front there as looking forwards, then using these buttons to control angle, I'll select like sideways, then velocity, and the robot travels sideways. Um, I can change the angle back and comes back the other way. Uh, go forwards, sideways, just speed up a bit, uh, look backwards, sideways. So this is just uh, without turning, without rotating, is travelling at uh, any angle I want. I can also rotate it. This ge the gearbox used for this model isn't as fast as the prototype scamper. Makes it a little bit easier to control because it can then use very slow speed for precise um, positioning of the robot.